And you know that old saying, everything's bigger in Texas? They ain't lying. <laughs> Y'all like my hat? I think I fit in now. The John Deere booth at Commodity Classic. You can tell it's much bigger than National Farm and Machinery Show. Say hi, Andrea. Hi, Andrea. <laughs> um, if I had a dollar for every time somebody asked me where Matt was, I would be 150 bucks richer. Hey, Kelly, where's Matt? You owe me a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> so they have these giant um, drills air seeders they've got the new tractor that was released and then they have the new combine over here for all you green lovers i will show you this is the x9 with an hd f50 header i know everybody's seen this one before yeah. all right so this is the s7 We'll go up in the cab. Okay, here's the cab. Almost like the sprayer cab I was in. Um, actually, exactly the same. A hydro handle. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. All right, give it to John Deere to keep the cabs the same. I do love this seat though, look at this. That is a nice feature, so you're not wrecking your back. Look at all those belts. Lots of belts, lots of belts. Very pretty though. Now walk over here to the S7 700. This is more of the styles that are in our area. It's pretty, right? Nice. Look at the monstrosity of this thing. We just asked how it got in here. We really didn't care anything about it. We just wanted to know how they got it in here. <laughs> a big booth. As you can tell, there's not a lot of people. It's very open, very big. All right, and here's the new tractor. It's giant John Deere. It's a 9RX 830. Okay, check this out. It is now a CVS that is a vending machine. Um, so you have everything. <laughs> Lovely friend Andrea is gonna mucinex. You need tongues. I mean, that is so cool. Allergy relief. I'm Everything. I want a snack for my baby. <laughs> snack for your baby. They even have like little swimmers in there. That is nuts. Welcome to Houston. Drone trailer. So all of them have different rows you can go up in, and they're small companies. <laughs> and then there's even a place for the kids to hang out. This is how big this place is. And there's even a cornhole tournament. So you can ship them your own corn and have it turned into your own whiskey with your farm name on the side. How amazing is this? Century Farms. Here's the information. There you go. So ready to start day two at the Commodity Classic, but I first wanted to show you the Airbnb that I found. I'm just kind of tired of staying to hotels and hotels charge way too much money. Outrageous prices. Uh, this week alone was close to $2,000 to $3,000. Uh, thankfully, um, my friend's company was willing to pay for it because we saved them money. So, I wanted to show you how amazing this Airbnb is. Look at the view. We're on the 10th floor, and at night it is absolutely gorgeous. 
And honestly, I really enjoy the decor because it's so different. So you have this view all the way around. And there's a bedroom there. And then you got the kitchen and then another bedroom over there. But honestly, I think the entire place is amazing. Look at this. So the convention center is right there. There's where everybody else is staying in the Hilton and Missy Suites. But look at this. This is the Toyota Center. Look at I mean. <laughs> so when all that spills, find you an Airbnb. Not only are you helping someone. Um, it's a lot more homey. It feels personable. And you don't have to pay all the outrageous hotel prices. So it's about a 10 minute walk. It's really safe. And honestly, you can't beat this. Okay, walking again. We're gonna go find uh, friends at the John Deere booth. But we're gonna do the case here in just a little bit. I wanted to show you everybody. We got uh bands playing over in uh bear pretty much all day long so they got the soy check off over here the booths are very big they got interactive stuff for the kids too we got massey ferguson and fence in the middle and we got the gleaner 3300 I got the same sprayer that was at the National Farm Machine Show. They've got the Massey tractors, which I'm gonna go in because I forgot to get that last time. You got precision planning. Just to show you the difference in the boost between the NFMS and this. It's more or like education orientated and business. Fent has a pretty large one, as you can tell. But look how big these are compared to what it was in National Farm. A lot more space. Like I said, this is more about doing um, business here and education. Got a few educational things over here at Mosaic. You know that guy, that is Brian Brown from Brian's Farming Videos with the Ideal Combine. And something new might be coming to the farm this fall. You're gonna have to stay tuned. Here we're over at the soy and I think it's hilarious that corn people are taking pictures in the soy. <laughs> These are my friends from the NCGA. Smile! Oh, look at this. Here we are again, all jacked up again. There's my lovely assistant. <laughs> and, oh, wait. And me, hi. So we're gonna walk around and show you some red equipment as well. New Holland, and you guys saw that the last one. Now we're gonna go over and see all the red. Case Magnums. <laughs> Their booth here is way bigger, more wide open. Uh, I'll go show the AF11, although Matt pretty much showed that last time, so it's good. 525 track. Sprayer and the AF11. They are giving tours to people that sign up. Um, I just didn't have the time for it. Uh, they're not letting anybody in the cab either. The difference between the show there and the show here is you can sign up to get a tour and they're gonna explain everything that is new on the combine. So that's why this show, in my opinion, is better because it's more hands-on. Yes, you do have to pay to be here unless you're uh, invited or part of the ASA, NCGA, um, if you're NCGA, you get a discount. ASA, you get a discount on prices uh, for the whole week. But you get receptions, they have better swag here, and then you get fed for three days. 
This is nuts. Look at this. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't be able to pull this anywhere if I tried. Look at this. Holy hoses. Wow. Oh my god. Look at this. What? You got your GPS right there. And then get your dry fertilizer and your seed and your liquid. And that is the new tractor they just released. Look at this. This is insane. This is the new tractor that was released here. Look at this. Stainless steel hoses. Check it out. Look at the front of this. Oh, I'm sorry. You're good. Like, I, I can't even reach up there to, like, pull the hood up. <laughs> it would not work for me. This is insane.